safi karibu tena double updates popote pale ulipo mtazamaji wangu mimi na tumai unaendelea vizuri kabisa naitwa Mr. Double J na kama kawaida hii hapa ni ulimwengu wa siasa leo imekuwa ni siku kubwa sana na wale commissioners wa zamani watume ambao inasimamia maswala ya uchaguzi hapa nyumbani plus 254 Uh, walikuwa boma sio wote kuna wengine waliogopa kama Chebukati uh, hawakufika uh, Chebukati alisema yeye alishamaliza kazi yake kwa hiyo haoni eti sababu ya kusiju kuulizwa maswali ama kuelezea kilichotokea au sio tukamuonea 18 tukajua wewe Chebukati ni muoga ulijua vizuri ulichokifanya. Kwa hiyo una aibu fulani ya kukutana na uh, watu bwana wa kuuliza maswali uh, labda atakushinda kujibu au sio. Nina uhakika na wewe unakuwa miongoni mwa watu ambao unatamani kujua ni kitu kipi ambacho kilitokea au ni vitu vipi ambavyo vilitokea pale usiku na wasiwasi na chokuomba ni baki na mimi mwanzo mwisho nitakuelezea ni kitu kipi kilifanyika au sio tunaanza moja kwa moja the national dialogue committee has been informed by three out of the four former independent electoral and boundary boundaries commission ibc commissioners that they were compelled to quit unaendelea sasa cha kwanza ambayo unatakiwa kujua na kilitokea leo ni kwamba cherera four wale sasa. E, hapo ndo unampata kina Masit, Cherera, I think Gulie, kama sija Gulie. Ah, ama wananichanganya watu sawa. Tumalizie tu eti ni nani uh, Cherera four. Nikisema Cherera four mtaelewa ni wale ambao walitoka wakasema sisi hatukubaliani na matokeo ya Chebukati. So cha kwanza wamesema wali okay kukua compelled ni kama kulazimishwa yani ku, kama ku force yes com, eh, compelled eh. kiingereza changu sio king lakini hiyo ku compelled hiyo na, naweza nikajua so they were compelled uh, to quit cha kwanza ambacho nataka kuelewa lakini pia as a result of president william ruto appointing a tribunal headed by court of appeal judge agri mchelule to investigate their actions in the 2022 elections Cherera Wanderi Nyangaya said they were compelled to resign from their position however they choose not to appear before the tribunal au sio bwana na wali 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 wei yani kama walijaribu ku eh? si kuna timu fulani ilitengenezwa na William Samoe Ruto ili hawa watu wachunguzwe <laughs> and i was like Ruto wewe utaki Cherera for Then Ruto huyu anatudanganya eti sasa yeye hataki kuwafukuza directly anatengeneza timu ambayo itafanya uchunguzi wa kuangalia hawa watu. Guys, hata nyie mlikuwa mna expect nini? Si ilikuwa automatic kwamba hii timu ilitengenezwa lakini na mission moja. Wale watu wenda mtapata kuna kitu walifanya kizuri au kulikwendaje, hawa watu inabidi waende wapi? Waende nyumbani. So kama kuna sehemu tulichezwa tu vizuri sisi kama wananchi ni hapo. Si eti kwamba eti tuli uh, okay kuna 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 sisi wengine ambao hatukupenda cherera for kufukuzwa. Si ni ukweli. Lakini si eti kwamba ndo inatuuma sana. Kinachotuuma zaidi ni kwamba tulidanganywa eti Ruto sasa hawezi akawafukuza direct. Eti kuna kitimu fulani kimetengenezwa timu yenyewe inalipwa. Eh? Kwa ajili ya kufanya uchunguzi wa kuwafuta na kuwafukuza akina cherera ilikuwa ni mchezo fulani ambao nyie hata nyie mlikuwa mnaona bana hii timu hakuna kitu ilikuwa inachunguza like ruto tu angewafukuza directly so lazima ingefuatwa vitu fulani fulani ambavyo pia havina havina mwanga yani hauoni hapa kinachoendelea but that's what they did so msha siku uh, wakafukuzwa so walichagua uh, upande wa kutoka hata kwenye uh, i think wali waliachia waliachia nani yule kuna mmoja alibaki kapambana kapambana sana lakini um, hakufanikiwa mwisho mm, siku alifukuzwa pia na yeye nakumbuka vizuri sana so walichagua kutoka kwenye um, <laughs> naweza nikasemaje yani yani kwenye uchunguzi huo yani walikataa yani kukaa pale eti waulizwe maswali sio waseme nini wajitetee kwa sababu they knew from the word go kwamba hapa ni kwenda tunaenda nyumbani na hatuna kitu kingine ambacho tunaweza kufanya hicho ni kitu cha pili 
Irene Masit, the fourth commissioner, appeared before the tribunal, uh, which in its recommendation suggested that she be removed uh, from office, to which she also tendered her resignation. Now, see, yeah, ali, ali tolewa, ata, ata, badai, sunajua kabisa ni, ata siyo badai, kabla. Ye, yeah, tayari, alikuwa asha sema mistaki. Mina wacha. Lakini bado wakaondolewa, so you are like, ah, what's happening? What's going on? Ama walidhani, aneza akarudi. Hapa, namutu wa kisha resign, si ame, ame, ame resign. Asha inda ivo. Ama? Yes. Um, so, hapa, anasema wenderi kwamba, we never tallied the results from the constituencies. And they were tallied by a hand-picked number of people who worked with the chairman. Huyo ni wenderi anasema. Hapa, sasa, ndo tunaingililia issue ya sava ndugangu. So inasemekana kwenye hii sava na kwenye kuhesabu hesabu moja mbili tatu hapa ndo sasa chebukati aliamua kutumia watu wengine sio hawa sasa makamishinas. Sio kama unanipata yani wa, waliamua sasa. Eh? Waliamua sasa hapa sasa akina Wenderi sio akina Cherera akina nani hawa wataki kujua kinachoendelea na kwenye constituency ni ni, ni, ni yeye kama chairman na watu wake ambao yeye ndo anajua ndo kabisa walitakiwa kufanya nini ndo walitakiwa kuhesa kuhesabu haya he asserted that wanderi cherera masita nyangaya were denied access to form 34c which is the presidential results form and that the professor huyo abdigulie and the ceo of commissioners were of, of the commissions were among those hand picked to conduct the tallying sasa hapa ndo chebukati alicheza mchezo wake. Unasikia? So akina sijui masit, akina cherera, hao waliwekwa kando. So ile ta, from 34C ile, sasa 34C ni ile final kabisa, ile ya ya rais huko mwisho sasa. Hapo wakanyang'anywa wao sasa hawezi waka access vitu vinafanyika huko nyu, yani yani mlango umefungwa inahesabika huko nyie mtakiwi kuona. One of the things ambayo Azimio walikuwa wanaimba hapa watu wanabani ni mchezo. So that's what happened. Anyway, inaniuma sana kama yani hizi stories zinaendelea sasa hivi and uh, hatuwezi tukapata hiyo justice ya kwamba you know ilikuwa imeibwa na nini we can you know turudi tuangalie tena. Inaniuma sana tunaipiga tu kama story but there is nothing ambayo inaweza kufanyika. Yaani ndo point yangu mimi unanielewa. So must say that the counting and verification of uh, election results that took place at uh, Kenya Bomas uh, during the 2022 election was not true. Yes. Uh, issue ya kuverify hapo sasa ndo ilikuwa ni noma. So, wao wow, hawakuruhusiwa uh, kusaidia kwenye kuverify and uh, uh, mwisho siku kilichotokea ni kwamba akina Chebukati na ndugu zake wale ndo kabisa wali walifanya hiyo kazi and uh, mwisho siku uh, ikawa results ikawa kama ndo hivyo tulivyoambiwa. Also. So hapa, she continued by saying that the chairman had kicked them out of their subcommittees and given them responsibilities outside of their purview. Right, but alafu chibukati alikuwa mjanja, eh, hey, alikuwa shajua yeye ndo chairman. Wee, hey, toka hapo wewe. Wee, kaa pale. Mm, toka hapo kaa pale. So anajua the reason why alikuwa na wa switch. Eh, na kumpe wewe, mm, toka tu, kuja, kaa pale. Eh, hey, wewe toka, kuja huku. Alafu sasa yeye ndo anajua ni, ni nini anafanya hapo. So inamaanisha wakati haya yote anaendelea mawasiliano yalikuwa. Yaani niamini usiamini mawasiliano yalikuwa yanaendelea kati ya Chebukati na timu yake William Samoe Ruto. Inawezekana hakuwa na wasiliano na Ruto directly lakini indirectly. Hiyo banaangalia hii timu ya Ruto. Kwani mtu anaweza kudanganya wako na wasiliana? No sometimes tuongee tu kweli. Mawasiliano yalikuwa hapa. Eh, lakini hiyo eh hiyo uwezo kaambiwa hiyo. Hiyo hiyo kaambiwa. So so far we are aware of the results and uh, it's crucial that we audit them. Mm. Wao hawajui kinachoendelea. Labda sasa wakiangalia like you know eh, what happened what's going on. Ndio kitu ambacho kinaendelea. Mimi nakwambia hiyo serve hiyo. Ah walikataa kuifungua lakini hiyo serve. Hiyo serve kulikuwa na mambo. Hiyo serve kulikuwa na mambo. Yaani ushiku ushiku na confidence ushikuwa na confidence like e servant ndo e servant ndo msema kweli hapa kwenye server hapa ndo kuna kitu lakini hawataki kutuambia na hawataki kutuonyesha si chebukata tupigie tu hata picha tu ndani tuone tu eh yani picha tu piga tu picha tuone 
ni nini hapa ni nini hapa kilikuwa kinaendelea hapo tutashukuru sana ndio masita ncherea claim to be exiles for security reasons uh, masita claim to have not been inside her house since uh, the results of the 2022 election were released hii hii wacha Cherera bana anasema Cherera pamoja na Masiti. Eh baada ya uchaguzi matokeo trust me hujai kulala kwenye manyumba yao. Kwa sababu hapo unaju... na mimi najua hata threats wamepata. Wachana Chebukati anasema alikuwa anataka kuuawa na nani? Eh huyu nani alikuwa anataka kuuawa Chebukati? Chebukati ndio mtu achane naye. Huyu hakuna kitu anatuambia. Hapo akina Cherera anajua alikuwa ameshapata eh wewe ukio wewe ukijaribu tu kuongea. Eh mtaona. Yaani kama mtajaribu tu kuongea hivi ebu mtatupata bana ebu uwe makini na mnachokizungumza au sio uh, i think mambo yalikuwa mengi sana eh, mambo yalikuwa mengi sana but must claim that despite being intimidated she did not call the police yani hata uwezi pigia polisi sasa uta unapigia unapigiaje polisi wakati ndo kabisa wako same mode so utapiga waseme eh amenipigia yuko same flani so unanyamaza tu utafanyaje so mambo yalikuwa ni kama hayo uh, i don't know maoni yako ni gani uh, ndugu dada mtazamaji Ah uh, utaniachia maoni yako hapo chini kwenye sehemu ya comments lakini kikubwa zaidi subscribe ili uendelee kupata taarifa nyingi na mpya kila wakati bye bye